Mount. Ryan Mares, très fort oh, Ryan Mares qui envoie les siens en finale de cette Coupe de Welcome to my channel, the DZV Next, where I always talk about the Algerian national team and their players. Today, I want to discuss the rumors surrounding the absence of Andy Dolor. Belmadi did not call him up. Many people are wondering why. There are some people who automatically went and said that maybe Belmadi had problems with Dolor, that he um, is, uh, you know, born from France when Belmadi, in fact, is born there himself and the majority of the players were born in France and not in Algeria. So that kind, that arg argument, in my opinion, is not the right argument. Other people saying it has to do with things he posted on Instagram. I mean, those things didn't really seem likely to me. Um, there is this one report that said that Andy Delors and Galtier, uh, the coach of Nice conspired and and made a deal, a contract. He should refuse to get called up and uh, not go play with the national team because supposedly Galtier had four players already who are going to play in the African Cup: Atal, Boudawi, Kamara, and Lamina. And in my opinion, this story seems a little sketchy because it's against a FIFA law to do something like that and it's cited in FIFA's principle 1.1 which says clubs are obliged to release their registered players to the representative teams of the country for which the player is eligible to play on the basis of his nationality if they are called up by the association concerned any agreement between a player and a club to the contrary is prohibited for this reason i'm not really sure if this story is legit or not yes this story um has been published in la jury de aujourd'hui i do not trust these algerian journalists that much so i don't know if i could rely on them and this article was also made by a journalist patrick guillard and he has an article about this as well. It could seem likely, but I feel like um, because it's legal and there could be severe fines from doing this, uh, I don't think that this could happen. The only reason this could happen, maybe a player and a coach, you know, would talk about this, but I don't think they'll actually write this into a contract. They said an, an anonymous source was doing this so maybe this anonymous source wanted to mislead Bilmadi into thinking um the law wanted to do that i doubt i doubt Bilmadi would fall for that though but who knows at one point i think for the games against zambia and botswana the law got called up and he said he couldn't make it i mean yes there was excuse uh, excuse of the corona you know, pandemic, which well, unfortunately, is still going on. But at that moment, it seemed like maybe Dolor didn't want to play um, as much as other players did, or he per or he probably had a personal problem. We don't need to make it blow it out of proportions and think that automatically because the law wasn't called up, it has to do with the player himself. Um, Delog is a very is a good player. We all know this. I don't think that Delog wasn't called up because of this. I also will not go as far as to say that Belmadi doesn't like Delog or Belmadi just doesn't want a player born in France to come because you know, as I said earlier, Belmadi is born in France and the majority of the team is born in, was born in France. I think it's probably something much more simple there's things that go it might be a discipline thing it might be who knows there's definitely something that's not related to football but also could be a personal life matter the law simply could have things to attend to um in his personal life um that requires him not to go that will enable him not to go to the national team
we can't assume that he hates the national team or that Ben Madi didn't like the Lor because he didn't call him up. We don't know everything. We don't know what goes on behind the scenes. There's several reasons this could happen in traditional sense. You know, the coach has what they have in their head and we do not know all the factors that go into making a list. Who knows? We don't know. We have to wait and see. And I'd rather not jump into conclusions and, um, you know, insult anyone, insult uh, Dolor or insult Belmadi because we don't know what's going on. And hopefully, and I think most likely, it will be cleared up. Basically, all I want to say, um, I'm very excited for these upcoming games. And there's new videos coming soon. See you next time.